Hey, it's down here. Uh, welcome to another episode of the Next Level Spartan Show. Today's topic for this show is what's the difference between influence versus inspiration? Okay, so what do I mean by that? I'm sure all of us have heard, and I'm sure you've heard that whole analogy or, or you know the statement that you should follow success, success leaves clues, that we should uh, not reinvent the wheel, um, you know, that we should pretty much model success, model successful people, study them, learn from them. Now, all these things are great, and I definitely agree with that, but I don't want you to fall into the same trap that I have fallen into. I've made this mistake, and it took me a very long while to actually realize this mistake. And now, only now, I have to turn everything around and try and fix this. So the mistake is, it's great to obviously feel and be inspired by someone. Being inspired by a mentor, someone that can help you push to the next level, get next level results. Let's say, for instance, myself. Let's say I teach you something, you feel inspired by it, and suddenly you want to you wanna lose weight. You, you want to join a training program, you want to do something and you want to change your life. Okay, that's great. I, I have inspired you to do that. Now, where the fine line comes in is if someone influences you. Now, yes, influence can be also positive, but in most cases, and, and in my case, it was actually kind of negative. And unfortunately, it takes us a very long time before we realize this. Um, I'm sure you've heard of, of cults and stuff like that, where the leader of the cult actually influences the people around him in that community to follow him and do or her and do exactly what he him or her wants you to do so i just want you to realize that there's a very fine line between these two things and i don't want you to fall in the same trap as what i did for a very long time um i had a couple of mentors and people that really really um inspired me in the beginning you know i was very inspired to do things but then there came a fine line where, where, where things switched up and I moved from being inspired by these people to being influenced by these people. And that pretty much meant that I changed my life around and completely changed things in my life. Now, yes, to a degree it was a great thing. Okay? I was able to change my life around, get out of a deep dark hole and move forward. But at the same time, they, at the same yeah at the same point there came a time where I was supposed to to leave things and 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 follow my own path and do do what I need to do but um, that's when I was influenced by these people you see um, and then I, I started doing things out of the ordinary things that that was not me things that I wouldn't generally do and I want you to just understand that it's great it's always great to learn from others it's always great to find mentors just watch out that you do not get influenced by people and rather get inspired by people okay so short message for today it's a very powerful one because i promise you i don't want you to wake up a year two three down the line going down a certain path following someone being influenced by that person and waking up one day and saying oh shit, how did i get here um, I had the right intentions, but I didn't want to go this far down the rabbit hole and it might just be too late for you to change things around. That's it. Remember to share this um, episode with a friend that you think can benefit from it. And please, just I'd love for you to comment below this video. Tell me what you think. Tell me if, if you're actually being influenced by someone or you're being inspired by anyone. I'd love to hear your views. That's it for today. Thanks for watching the Next Level Spartan Show. I hope you have an awesome day. Cheers.